Quit filing your own motions, all right? If you have a lawyer, you need to quit filing your own motions. If you have an idea for a motion, talk to your lawyer about it. But here's the thing. If you have counsel and you're filing motions, uh, the judge is going to dismiss them anyway because when you are represented by counsel, motions filed yourself don't count really. They're, they're void. Like the judge just gets to summarily dismiss them and say, go through your lawyer. So quit filing this stuff. Uh, because what happens is the judge is going to get mad at the lawyer and say, hey, get your client under control. Tell them to quit filing stuff. Then we're spending our energy on going back and forth about this stuff instead of reviewing your discovery, prepping appropriate motions for your case, and fighting for you and defending the accused every single day like we do. Okay? So if you have a, an attorney, they know what they're doing. Quit filing your own motions. Instead, talk to your lawyer about if there are appropriate motions in your case. Clients know the facts of cases better than most people a lot of times, right? No matter what, even if they're completely innocent, maybe they have a complete alibi. The client knows those facts, and the law, it's a great tool for the lawyer. Lawyers have got to communicate with their clients about that, but that does not mean that the clients need to be filing their own motions. It's not the right way to go about it. If you have questions about motions in your case, if you don't have, if, or maybe you don't have counsel, uh, and you're looking for a lawyer to help you file motions, uh, subscribe for more information and call us at 470-635-1725.